You know, really, um, that is, I think, at the base of the controversy about uh, the gay lifestyle is that some people think it's a choice, and some people think that it's something that it's a it's predestined that right. you know. And and I think um, those that think it's a choice probably have um, a much narrower view of of how these people are living their lives. Well, I suppose you're probably right. Um, I and I know we've talked about this before, but you know, I I don't. I don't believe it's a choice, and I don't think you do either. Mm-hmm. But, uh, but you know, we at the end of the day, we we don't have all the you know re- scientific facts and mm-hmm. and this sort of thing. I just don't know why someone, if they did choose to be gay, would do it in Kansas. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> if you're going to be gay in Kansas, boy, you better be tough. And um, so. You know, that was a big part of my motivation for, for making this was, uh, you know, I'm, I'm seeking answers myself. I'm a Christian, and mm-hmm. um, I'm not shoving any agenda. Right. Uh, either way, I'm just telling a story, and mm-hmm. I think people really appreciate that. Um, everyone who's seen it, uh, including Pastor Joe, mm-hmm. who um, has really loved it, and uh, and that's meant a lot to me. We talked about our screenings um, we had our world premiere in October at Roxy's downtown, mm-hmm. uh, which was tremendous. Sierra Scott was the MC, which well, of course. is of course she MCs everything, which is a great start. <laughs> yeah, uh, the mayor was there, Jeff Longwell, um, my good friend Shelley Stedman, who's the mayor of Mulvane, and it was really, really cool. Um, it was kind of a who's who of Wichita. Mm-hmm. And then we turned around and had another one at Roxy's and nearly sold that one out too. And um, Gosh, we've screened at some churches up in the Kansas City area in Topeka and um, been in the Kansas International Film Festival and, uh, and a couple others and we're continuing to make... Uh, you we're didn't screen it at the Westboro Baptist Church, did you? Not <laughs> yet, but you never know. <laughs> Westboro is actually following us on Twitter. Really? Uh, yeah, which, uh, and they retweeted us huh. a couple times, which I find odd, but that's another show. Yeah. Uh, upcoming screenings, though, uh, we're hitting a lot of college campuses this spring. Mm-hmm. Um, on February 23rd, we'll be at Butler County Community College in El Dorado. Okay. Uh, that's a Thursday, and that'll be from 11 to noon at the Welcome Center. Okay. Uh, and then five days later on February 28th, which is a Tuesday, um, we're going to be at the Andover campus at the Grizzly Den in the Student Union. Mm-hmm. Uh, gosh, in March, in March sometime we're going to screen at Southwestern College, okay. which is a, you know, Methodist school. It was... Very conservative. It wasn't easy, but yeah. uh, at the end of the day, once once they actually watched it, they really appreciated what we were trying to do, and um, it was one of their own. Okay. So um, we're going to have an event there. And then in April, uh, we're going to be going to KU, K-State, and Wichita State. So uh, if you're interested in attending any of those, it, they're either free or they're, you know, just a couple Minimal bucks. Minimal charge, yeah. Right? Um, go to outhereincansas.com. And uh, I, I try to update the blog with, with everything we're doing and, mm-hmm. um, and that sort of and, thing. And the outhereincansas.com will keep you updated as far as where where and when the screenings are. And yep, yep. You can find out here in Kansas on Twitter, Facebook, all that stuff. Um, we're not hard to find. Mm-hmm. So. Very cool. Well, congratulations on this because I know it's been very successful for you. And, and I think um, that, that the message that you're putting out there is is one that everyone really needs to hear. So um, thanks for doing that. Well, thank you, Cheryl. (laughs) Appreciate it. And we'll be back in just a couple minutes with more Your Hour. John Ellert from Gallery 12 joins us next, so stay with us.